Good day everyone, I am Jason van Yeden and I am the registered dietitian at Irene Village Care. So today I would like to talk a little bit more about sweets and you know these bad foods and these things that you just love to have. So if you do have a problem food as you know what we might call it. So let us maybe use rusk as an example. You love your morning rusk but you find that you know while you're sitting out there on your porch or wherever you are having your rusk you generally reach in for another one and then for another one and then for another one. Next thing you know half the packet's gone or it's a chocolate you get you know if you've had a long day you put that chocolate down next to you like oh I'm just gonna have two blocks. Next thing you know it's four blocks. Next thing it's six. Next thing oh you know what the packet's almost done I might as well just finish it. And the thing is it's not those aren't bad foods. It depends and of course on other medical conditions that you may have that of course changes the situation but if you love types of food what I genuinely suggest as a bit of a practical tip is let's take rusk for example you know that if you take that whole basket with you or that bucket of rusk and you put it next to you you might actually tend to go and have one of those rusks a bit more than what you should or that you know that you shouldn't have so what you can do is that you can specifically take only one rusk with you when you go have your you know you go sit down and have your coffee or a tea in the morning for example or another way you can do it is take those rusks, get seven little Tupperwares or little plastic bags that you have lying around, and then you can then, you all then know, one is for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Every day when you now have your coffee or your tea, that willpower, you are strong, you literally just take one bag or one small Tupperware, and you know, I can enjoy this. In my opinion, it is a bit better to you know, have a small little bit of your treat, you know, let's say often, that it is good for your soul, soul food, then the risk, having the risk of having, you know, a whole slab of chocolate, you know, one or two times a week because we do struggle with self-control, especially at the end of the day or when we're waking up. We all know that, you know, before coffee, it might be a bit of a problem. So those are just two tips that I basically just have is, you know, rather only take the, you know, the part that you want and when you go sit down and you leave the rest behind, so it's not next to you, or you can then divide it into, you know, a certain amount of Tupperwares or plastic bags, depending. Um, and then when you want to then have it, you only then take one of them. Self-control is a lot better and it's going to be more better for your sustainable goals. So guys, I'm Jason van Heeren, the registered dietitian at Irene Village Care. This is your quick diet tip for the day. Have a wonderful day. Bye.